Rob from the Off Grid Tiny House. Here's some dates, times, temperatures for you. Oh yeah. So, my dad's next door working on his trailer. I helped him out for this morning, basically. Um, today we're going to be looking at mounting these solar panels, possibly. Um, my dad has these aluminum bars we saved and cut up. So I'm going to use these as brackets for the solar. Now, <clears throat> one thing I'm going to do is just mount them like so and then just screw in um, so far and then I'll be bending these and cutting these so they're you know gonna work out for us so let me get you a better angle hopefully maybe <laughs> so I'm thinking of just doing the ends like so so we're just gonna run a one inch screw self tapper through there galvanized and these are totally aluminum and so is the frame and I just got to make a mark at 90 where to bend this and then I'll have to cut off the excess obviously and I'm gonna leave a lot of surface area on there because when I go through the center that'll kind of act like a washer and give us that grab power and this is the back side, which is what I want. Now the only thing I'm worried about, which I experienced with the other panels, is bowing. Will this bow in the center? And chances are, I'm guessing yes. But, who? I think that four will do. Um, two at both ends. And I think that's going to work. So I'm going to mark this I got a marker here and uh, keeping that surface area like I said I'm kind of like flush to the to the top and I'll go back about here and the hole that I'm going to send through I'll mark that as well so it's going to be around here that way I don't damage the cells whatsoever. <clears throat> and if I mark this and do a bend and try it, this will be my test piece. I'm going to go bend this, try it, and if it's good, I'll make a template. Then we'll cut off the excess and go from there. So there we go. So this mark I just did, just recap. I'm going to put that into a break and bend it 90 degrees. So we'll go try that and I'll get back to you. Well guys, we tried that mistake and they are super brittle. So no good. So I got to get some proper brackets because those broke like nothing in the break. So yeah. Got to get some galvanized ones, I guess. Something with some strength. Alright, marker time. I gave you one. Right here. Now, I got to see something first. These screws are going to hold this hole. Yes. Sweet. Now, this may be too big. Oh yeah, too big. Well, we'll just do it without it. No, I got more in the truck. Wait, I'll see if I can get you the exact one. 
And for an impact gun, too, with the hex end. Hex end? Me. All right, so basically, I was checking here, guys, to see if the self, the one inch self tappers will, the head will fit in, fit on there, and it does. Sorry about the bad focus. Don't have a camera crew, can't afford one. YouTube's screwing me hard. So, that's what I'm dealing with. Check it with your screw, see if you're... But it's too big or just yeah, right? I've got a littler one here. If you need it. i got one that's a little tinier than that. This one might do it. Well, here, this one right will do it for sure. Yeah. Let's try that one. Goes right in here. Yeah, but that's impact. It doesn't matter. matter, so does that. Yeah, but well, whatever. Real, not impact. Impacts for sure. Okay. Let's try it. Now you gotta make sure you got the same measurement for all of them big. So make sure you keeping track of that. It's a double layer. There's a hollow joint in there. That's it. Now let's try the impact. No, it's that double spin on you. Just go slow. Yeah. pretty good. Now we got to do the exact same down here. We'll do this then while you're up in the air. That. What do you want? Down at this end? Yeah, no, I got to well I got to match this up first. We got to know where we're going here. Well, you take a tape measure. I got one in the truck. The tape measures are here. So if we're on this line, yeah, we're down this one now. Yeah. So so it's about there, right? There's a marker if you want to mark it. Yeah, that's about the same. Okay, I'll move this chair. I'll have to sit down here to do this. Get an impact ready for us, and we'll be ready.
not quite Either. square to the world, but... Yeah, well, you're okay. Not really. Because you want to make it sit flat up there. Now two on that end and then we'll check to see, we'll lay it right on the floor in here and see if it's bows or does anything. <laughs> 